Hello, it's Hacker 7 and in today's video, I'll be showing you guys how to make your own QR code. A QR code is what you see right here. It is a square with a certain pattern of black and white dots, which allow a smartphone user to scan the QR code and execute whatever the QR code says to do. QR code is very useful for advertisements on like billboards, because now instead of having to type in a whole YouTube URL or a website URL, Smartphone users can now scan the billboard and easily get to whatever the QR code wants them to do. So it is very simple to make one using a website called qrstuff.com. Here's the website. Go below, you can get to it. It's very simple to do. And they have millions of different options on what you want to make. So you can do anything from a website URL to a Google Maps location, Twitter, Facebook. Um, this is one of my favorites right here, an app store download. So if you've made an app for any device like Blackberry, Windows, um, iTunes for Apple, or Google Play for the Android devices, you can select one of them, give your Google Play address, it will generate it for you. Now you can put that on paper, anything, and when someone scans it, it will instantly open up their app store and allow you them to download the app. You can also do things like plain text, telephone number, Skype call, text message, email address, email message, contact details, Wi-Fi login for Android devices, and PayPal. So I'll show you guys how to make one. I'll do a couple different examples, and then that'll be it. So let's say I wanted to do a website URL. So if I wanted to do one for my YouTube uh, main channel, I can just type it in. And then after, as you see, as I type it, it also generates a QR code preview over here. So the more digits you type in, the more complex the code is, um, just because the more digits. So you can also use their URL shortener if you prefer. And you can tell, as soon as I hit the URL shortener, it actually gets more brickier. But as soon as I go back to this, it gets more like complex. So that is what it. So now once you've typed it in, you can also have the option to change the color by just bringing it anywhere like this. And what you do is you can also grab the scale, just like Microsoft Paint, and click around. So once you've just find a color that you like. Now once you've found a color that you like, you can leave it black if you prefer. Once you found one that you like personally, go ahead and click download QR code. It will instantly download a simply a picture, and there we go, our QR code is now done. Now to actually use a QR code for BlackBerry devices, all you have to do is open up BBM, and you can click Add Invite to BBM, and then sc click Scan Barcode, and you can actually scan that, and it will execute my URL. If you're on an iPhone or Android device, it's pretty much using an app, or the camera app, or something along those lines where you can easily scan it. So it's the same for all of them. Um, if you go to Twitter, you can click Twitter profile or you can have it actually tweet. So you can go Twitter profile, type in my username, which is the hacker 7 on Twitter. And then boom, it gives that. I click download. I now have my new QR code. So as you guys can tell, it's very simple to do. And once you've gotten this, you can easily put it on your YouTube banner. You can put it on um, a website, anything, and it's really simple for people to easily scan the cart, the code, without actually having to type in the long URL. So the process is the same for all of them, so there's no point in me going through all of them, but you can do things like Skype call, um, Skype username here, and you note this only works on iPhone and Android devices that have Skype app already installed. So like I said, Dropbox, telephone number, anything. It's a really cool website, guys. I said just checking it out, and if you enjoyed this video, thumbs it up, and share it with your friends. Anyways, guys, that's all for this video. Hope you enjoyed. Subscribe for more videos and see you in the next one. This is the Hacker Triple 07, and I'm signing off.